Hey guys, it's JB here, and I'm going to be taking you through my stream setup today uh, for Blue Microphones. And this is a walkthrough of what's in the basement for me. All the best stream setups are in the basement, by the way. Never let anybody tell you differently. Uh, so this will be a look at uh, what's behind the camera when you watch me stream. Now, first of all, we have our Herman Miller chair here. Uh, it's a little pricey, but if you're ever going to be sitting someplace for 8, 10, 12, sometimes even 24 hours in a row, you want to make sure that you've got uh, someplace comfy and it's going to you know, take care of your rear end and your back and uh, not fatigue you while you're sitting there. So it's been, uh, it's been a good piece of hardware. Now, obviously, your peripherals are important, and we've got a bunch of Logitech stuff here. You see the wireless mouse and the uh, recharging uh, mouse pad, excuse me. And these are really nice. Make sure you don't get any cords caught on anything and you don't have to deal, you know, mess around with batteries or any of that. And you got the, the keyboard here. Now I've got the, the RGB turned on. I don't usually leave it that way, but some people like it. And uh, so we'll kind of show that off. Uh, and then the dual monitor setup. And this is important for streamers because you want to be able to play your games on one monitor and then be able to look at Twitch chat on the other monitor uh, or check Discord or something like that. So uh, I'm guessing most of you that are watching this probably already have to, but if you don't, definitely make that upgrade. Uh, now this is my gaming PC, and this is a, a dedicated gaming PC. I have a dual PC set up. Uh, and then over here is the streaming PC where I take care of all of the encoding uh, for my stream. And so between the two of those, uh, you know, you can make sure that you get maximum FPS on your gaming PC and also uh, fully dedicated encoding on the streaming PC to hopefully make the stream as crispy as possible for everyone watching. Uh, and then a rather recent addition to my setup here is the mixer. And I got my mic plugged into this and then my gaming PC runs through it and it um, then outputs to the streaming PC. So I make sure that I've got uh, the mic running to both PCs so I can both talk to stream and discord on my gaming PC at the same time and uh, push through all the audio from the, from the gaming PC that you'll want to hear. And then lastly, we got that stream deck right there and that makes it so that you got easy push button access for uh, doing stuff with your stream, either, you know, emotes or scene switching or muting your stream or whatever. So pretty handy little piece of hardware. And uh, then obviously the microphone that you hear me talk through all the time, uh, the blue spark, and then the uh, compass, the arm that comes with it. And these are really handy for being able to swing the mic around and uh, keep it in front of you at all times. Now here's the back of the stream. And I like to refer to my stream setup as a, a bit of a mullet design where it's business in the front, party in the back. And by that, I mean that uh, there's virtually zero cable management back here. We just kind of sling stuff where it goes and... Hopefully nobody dies on it. Uh, lastly, you can see the lights here in the camera. Um, those are mounted to my desktop, which is an Ikea, by the way. Uh, pretty affordable and gives you a ton of desk space for pretty cheap. So plenty of room to clamp stuff and have your monitors and whatnot spread out and still give you a lot of real estate to work with. So I've been real happy with that. And uh, that kind of, you know, wraps it up for what you've seen here. So if you've been curious about what my setup looks like and how I, uh, you know, my dual PC stream, mixer, any of that stuff, this is a firsthand look at what goes on from my end of it. And uh, hopefully it's answered any questions you have. If, if it didn't, if there's any questions you still have, feel free to leave them in the comments, ask me anything about it that you want, and hopefully I can answer it uh, but otherwise i hope you've enjoyed this little walkthrough <laughs>